What's up, everybody? Jace here for jazbeescasebreaks.com. We just sold out 2024 Tops UFC Chrome 2 box break. Random divisions number two, guys. Features a box of Breakers Delight and a box of Hobby. And again, guys, uh, nine spots where we get to random division from the list below. All cards ship. And uh, let's rip, or let's randomize then rip, I guess. Six and a one, seven times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Six, one, and seven. John down to Joe. Um, so what, what's going on with the promotion? What, 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 what promo are you talking about? There's a UFC promo? What, what do you have to do to... 6 and 7. seven. Uh, men's Bantamweight down to Men's Flyweight. All right, so John, you have bantamweight, Robert with heavyweight, D Porter with middleweight, Tristan with men's welterweight as well, uh, Joe with lightweight, Eric Laspamojo light heavyweight, Tristan with men's featherweight, Simon, you have the women's flyweight, strawweight, and bantamweight, and then Joe with the men's flyweight. All right, let me know if there's gonna be any trades. All right, let's just close this. No, I get what you're trying to say with like it's a, there's a UFC main thing, but what what is somebody gonna win like, and what do they have to do? Like, are they gonna win a a, a ticket to the fight or what's going on here? What what promotion are you talking about? Let me see. You said it's on Tops Ripped. So if you pull any of those two fighters cards, what do you do? You just trade it in for store credit?
Oh, that's cool. So then you gotta figure people are gonna be wanting to buy in store, and if they pull them, they could uh, get some store credit. I'm trying to find where that you said where's that at, but I only see like articles on like Topps Chrome, not like any any like buyback stuff. Alright, here we go, guys. We got Renato, lightweight. And we got a Dominic Gray as light heavyweight to 199. We got a purple Gilbert Burns. Brad Katona. Michael Chandler, lightweight. Mike Davis. Kind of cool. And then we got a straw weight. Mizuki. And that's going to go to uh, Simon. Mossar. Marcos. And we got a Sean O'Malley to 299 Bantamweight. What a John. And we got a Yuri. Light heavyweight to 25 autograph. Uh, light heavyweight is Eric. Last ball mojo. Damn. Pretty cool. We have this Raul Rosas. Whoa, did we get a bonus on him? Tatsuro. Bonus auto. That's a flyweight going to Joe. Three. Three autographs there. Brandon Moreno purple. Got a Habib countdown. Manuel Torres. Paul Craig. And then Gastelum. Middleweight. Just going to deep Porter. That's what I'm going to say right now, Deep Porter. You're speaking it into existence, you freaking wizard. I don't know if this is like a shorter peninsula, but I hadn't seen this one yet. That's a cool one. You're a freaking wizard. Breakers Delight, let's see. The Hugh Porter is in fact a wizard. Calling a red. Remember, he, did, he didn't just say red auto, he just said red. So, it could be anything. Parker Porter. Strictly. Ooh, Energize. Is that like a shorter print insert? I feel like I haven't seen that one. Well, we have a redemption, though. And another Tatsuro. We'll hide that, though. 
But Leo Muhammad to 299 welterweight. Then we got Valentina Shevchenko to 99. It's going to go to Simon. And then we got Ariane Lipsky. All right, who are we calling as a redemption? Are you still going to you want to be a wizard again? Who are we thinking? Actually, I shouldn't use him as a blank. He's an autograph. Well, nice come up there for the flyweight, though, which is Joe. Usually, redemptions are usually bigger fighters, right? Or old school guys that just didn't want to sign. No wizardry for the name. Ooh, Chrome Rookie Autograph. Refractor Parallel. I was hoping for the red Refractor Parallel, but... Starts with a T. H. Demba. Gorimbo. Let's look that fighter up because we need to make sure that he's, we need to know what division he's in. Every kiss begins with K. What? Where's the checklist at? Oh, wait. Beckett has her right here. Yeah, no, I, I'm just as clueless as you guys. Like I told you guys, I don't really watch this as much anymore. Uh, it just says Themba. Because <laughs> Beckett doesn't actually tell us the weight classes. Maybe uh, Topps Chrome, maybe Topps has a D XL. Is it Welter? I was, was, if I can't find it in the checklist, my next best guess was just look this dude up on like UFC, UFC stuff, you know, just to make it official, obviously. But, I mean, I, I, thankfully he's not like a big fighter, I guess, so. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. He's 12 and 4, though, I guess. So I don't know. Can't rule the guy out yet. Not a bad record. Uh, but yes, he is welterweight. He's welterweight. But you know, I like to go official by the checklist, but you know, when we can't find it on the checklist, what are you going to do, right? You gotta look up the next, uh, next best thing, which is like another source or, or Wikipedia or whatever. But yes, welterweight, which is going to go to Tristan. Not the right welterweight on there. Looks like he just... F when did he just fight? He won, right? TKO over P. Rodriguez. On February 3rd, he just he just fought. He was fighting on fight nights, though. Yeah, it's crazy how forward losses is already a lot, right? <laughs> Alright, uh, so was it welterweight? Well, hey, there's plenty of this, guys. And obviously, we just opened up the case with number one. So, hey, but we got an extra autograph, though. And I mean, obviously, the Yuri there orange isn't probably too bad, right? So there you go, guys. Thank you guys so much. Uh, like I said, we have more in the store. Let's get the next ones going. Appreciate it, guys. Thank you.